Hey YouTube, I just want to do a quick video here. Um, W77 just came out with a video entitled uh, Over 24,000 Pounds of Beef Recalled Unfit for Human Consumption. But, uh, and this has happened many times in the past. I'm sure you guys have probably seen some of these videos. I don't buy it. I think that uh, this stuff probably ends up in a bunker somewhere. Uh, you know, you'd have to be blind to not know that uh, we're heading for some real rough uh, weather. And, um, you know, the farmers are really suffering, um, you know, with the floods and everything. I mean, a lot of them have just called it quits for this season. And food prices are already going up. Food shortages are already hitting with the t climate issues that we're having. And um, so I just want to remind everybody to store food and um, because there's just no guarantee that it's going to be there tomorrow on the shelves. So stock up, be prepared for what's coming, and um, try and learn to grow something. I mean, we're, we're working really hard here to get our garden going again. We kind of let it go because I was spending way too, too much time making videos. But uh, I'm backing off of that. And I'm glad to see some other people stepping up and, and uh, covering um, my absence and um, giving some new insight on what they see as well. Um, with that, uh, um, We Do Not Consent Ohio just came out with a pretty interesting video. Cleck was uh, complaining that uh, his, uh, you know, his channel got hacked or something, his server got hacked and he lost a bunch of data and stuff. And, uh, you know, my take is I wish he'd have lost it all because I'm sick and tired of him pumping that poison out all over the planet with YouTube's protection. I can't even um, save someone else's video to uh, my The Jonathan Collect Cult playlist. Um, so, I mean, he, he's, out, he's obviously being protected by somebody on the inside, some kind of gatekeeper with YouTube. But with that, I just... Uh, I want to encourage you guys to store food, store water, store supplies, store medicine, store even pet food. Don't forget your pets. Um, try to have alternative energy sources. Uh, there's a lot of those out there. Um, keep in mind generators and things need fuel to burn. So, um, you know, diesels, you can burn vegetable oil and other kinds of oil uh, with that. But, um, you know, solar would probably be a good way to go as well. But look into, look into uh, alternative energies and uh, see what you can do about taking care of your own family because the Bible says that uh, the one that doesn't take care of his own uh, family is worse than an infidel, which is a non-believer. So with that, I'm going to cut it short. Love you. Mean it. If I can do anything for you, let us know. And stay close to Jesus. Read your scriptures yourself. Okay? Don't let anybody interpret the scriptures for you. You know, you want to listen to their point of view, fine, but compare it to what the scriptures say. You're accountable. You're not going to be able to stand in front of Jesus on Judgment Day and the Father on Judgment Day and uh, you know, say, well, so-and-so said this and so-and-so said that. He says, well, you had the book. Why didn't you read it? It's going to be crickets. So with that, take care. God bless you. Bye now.